this barn is harvesting equipment. Bunch of implements under the trees. Horse drawn, tractor drawn. This one's somewhat modern. This is uh, your PTO shaft. You can hook up to the back of the tractor with these universal joints. Drives off your transmission. You just connect it, lock it in place, hook up your hinge pin, your hinge, hitch pins here, pull it along with you. Cuts the hay down. Volunteers come on weekends, keep the equipment running. Not these pretty much, these pretty much stay in the barn, kind of looking at. But like this old truck here. How's it going? Hey, Greg, how are you doing? Hey, good. I'm filming a little video. Do you mind telling me about your D2? Oh, sure. This is a 1950 Caterpillar D2. It's set up as an agricultural tractor. So there's no dozer on the front. It's all the work gets done at the rear. It'll pull a disc or a plow or whatever type of implement you want. It's also got a belt pulley attachment that can turn any type of implement or uh, piece of equipment that's got a belt drive. Belt drive, yeah. Yeah, so. So this is a, uh, a two-cylinder. No, is a, actually, this is a, it's a four-cylinder. Four with a two-cylinder gasoline pony motor. Oh, wow. So the gas motor starts the main. I thought the D2, because a D6 is a three-cylinder, I believe, right? And that's low, low RPM powerhouse kind of. Yeah, but a D6 is also a uh, four or six cylinder. Four or six cylinder, yeah. yeah. And then that's a 1948 D4 in front of it. Same wow. deal as far as uh, agricultural tractors. Mm -hmm. And um, the cool thing is the dealer still has a lot of parts for them. No kidding. Yeah. Wow. Yeah. So you're a member of the of the museum, and you you took on the responsibility of. Uh, Restoring these, yes, yourself. So these are two your projects, right? But these are uh, these are my tractors, and then I do all the field work for the museum. And we just planted wheat in the three fields over here, so it took a lot of work to prep. You had to plow it and then disc it, 
and then a harrow, and yeah. then seed. So we were up here quite a few times doing that. And during the festival of the parade and all that, where they're shucking the corn and they're grinding flour with the wheat, this right. is something that's grown here on the on the property then? We'll do a demonstration on cutting the uh, wheat with an antique harvester. So, wow. And what's Ang your name? Angelo Kappas. Angelo. Hi, Angelo. Uh, thank you for sharing your uh, your tractors with us. Yeah, you bet. Yeah, sounds good. Thank you for yeah. coming out.